Hello again everyone, Age of Dune here, and we're back with another StarCraft 2 ranked game, queuing up again as Zerg, of course. Hopefully this game will go a little better than the last game. Honestly, I wasn't too displeased with the last game. Uh, I did lose it, but in large part it was just because he was ahead of me in macro and I didn't counter what he actually did. He went for a very greedy build, and I should have attacked with roaches earlier or something like that. I didn't. And I ended up falling behind. I, I was behind most of the game, really. Because he was, like, one step ahead of me the whole time. Ooh, PvZ. Interesting. Acceptable. Yeah, he, he was one step ahead of me for quite some time. And really, I, I just fell behind like that. I, I needed to do something else. I did manage to go ahead and use my Zerglings to take out his queens and stuff. Which, I mean, that right there actually made me pretty happy. Because that's something I don't normally do. But I, I should have been able to do more. I just didn't react as well as I should have. One good thing for me to do, I think, would have been to go ahead and work, you know, pull out a couple of those zerglings that made it into his base and took out the queen. Pull a couple of those over and try to warp them into Bailing, see if I could take out his mineral line. Had I been able to do that, he would not have come out nearly so well. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't, and I just stayed behind on the macro. Also, the fact that I was... I believe I ended up losing the final battle there because my concave was not as good as his. He attacked from a really good position, so I ended up coming out behind on that as well. So... Live and learn, you know? It's something that I, I do know, again, that I need to get better at. It's, uh, something I will get better at. I just need to actually do it. I didn't actually check that area, so we're gonna go ahead and come on over here, check this, and then come on back. I just want to make sure he's not doing any sort of a... Well, there's that. Okay, so he actually doesn't know about my drone down here yet, amusingly enough. I'm gonna go ahead and pull that guy away. My guy down there is actually being somewhat useless for the moment, but hopefully, because of the fact that it's not here. Crap, this guy's gonna be here just in time. Got it! Okay. Come on back, buddy. I'm back. Alright, so that actually went pretty well there. Just to see what he's got going on here. Not much. Not much at all. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and get this started now. And, uh, yeah. Just kind of carry on for the moment. On you. Interrupt that. There we go. Alright, we'll send this guy on back now. I think I actually might have interrupted a little more than intended as well. Let me make sure that he did do that. There we go. One, one thing to keep in mind though, because of the fact that I did do that, it, it actually did delay my own base by a little bit. So I am actually slightly behind because of that, but honestly, I think it should be okay. Go for this next. I do, I definitely want to keep an eye out on him though, because I want to make sure that he's not doing any sort of a, uh, you know what, we'll just do this. Control there. All right. That way I can make sure he's not doing any really aggressive thing here, because honestly, I kind of expect he is, just based on the fact that he still hasn't expanded. I don't know. I, I could be wrong, though, because he does have his drone there. Or his probe. He's got his probe there. So, when you look at it that way, it, it actually is... There we go. Okay, so he has started that. So that's definitely good to know. He is definitely behind there. Alright, come on back. Now you can come back for sure. I'll do that. That guy is up. And we need to get another one of these started. Put that on that. 
I don't care. For right now, we're about to so. Oh, he got my uh, overlord there. That's unfortunate. Definitely unfortunate. Not really too big of a deal. Do there, do that. Actually, it is a pretty big deal, to tell you the truth, but... Alright. Come on back now. We're gonna put you right there. There we go! All those guys there. Those three there. There's that. Alright, where are those guys? You, come on over here. You, come on over here. And you, go on over there. Also, gonna go ahead and make another one of them. And... Give me an overlord started again soon. As well as this, actually. But I need some more minerals first. All new guys are coming down here now. There. Alright, so I'm going to start this pretty quickly. Uh, that is an oracle. I see that. Let's get this guy over here. Get that guy over there. And uh, for now... There we go. Let's get that going. Alright. Um, there we go. Okay, so he's gonna get a little bit here. But he loses his oracle for it. So I would definitely say that was worth it. For me, not for him. Definitely not for him. I do want to go ahead and get me another one of these as well here. Alright, about now I'm going to go ahead and start working on my, uh... Actually that first. Roach army here. Because I, I do expect him to have something of an attack coming up pretty quickly here. going as well. And there we go. Get a few hydralis coming along here as well. There we go. Get that. This guy is actually a bit behind. But, honestly, it's okay. You guys come on over here. Get that going. I also want to go ahead and get this started because I am floating a lot of minerals. And heck, let's go for this one too. Did I not send you down here? I did, okay. Oh. Alright, so we're definitely getting up to a very good point here. We can do that. Get that going. I should... Oh, that's what happened. I was wondering why this guy was over here. Apparently, I do... No. Okay, there he is. You carry on. Okay. Taking damage? No, he's not. All right. Some more 
Okay. So, unfortunately, of course, I am low on overlords. I'm just going to spam the heck out of overlords here. Also, I apparently need to work on some Vespian gas here. That going, get this going. That is done. This is there. I need to upgrade this as well. I need more Vespian gas. Come on, guys, give me my gas. That going. Um. You three there. You three. Not you. There. Um. Let's see. There. All right. Just get the. Uh, that is already going right. Get this on the way, however. And they separate, of course. Uh, one thing I do probably want to do, actually, is get one of these guys and turn him into that. Hopefully it's not too late. Let's see, what does he have? Does he have anything here? Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. So, yeah, he's got nothing. So we're pretty much about to push to win this. Because he's got nothing. Could be wrong. Let's pull these back. He's got a lot of void rays, but I do have a lot of hydras too. And of course, I've got the macro to completely offset it eventually. I just have to actually get them together. And make sure that he doesn't finish me before I before I manage to get all my guys. But I've got enough Vespian gas coming in. I should be able to go ahead. You guys are now control group one. Unfortunately, I am missing some, but uh, yeah. Dang it. Okay, from the looks of it, he did have an expand over here, so we're gonna go ahead and take that out really fast. And we're gonna try anyway. Why do I have so many overlords coming over here? What the heck? Hopefully I'm not losing those guys as we speak. I know I'm losing some, but I, I should actually have enough. There we go. Pretty sure I came out of this one ahead then. Because I have finished off his air army. My macro, my superior macro one through. Let's go ahead and take this out really fast here. Alright, let's 
bring them on up. Let's focus this down because it is actively working. And really, I think we're pretty much done here. I, I cannot see him winning this, but I really need to not be uh, not be too complacent because he actually still can come back from it. It's just going to be really hard. Uh, okay. I'm not going to base race this guy. I have no reason to. So yeah, I just lost that base, but honestly, to tell you the truth, that is okay. He did, however, pull my army back. So I mean, that is good news for him. What is not good news for him, though, is that he still doesn't have enough of an army to defeat me. these out really fast. Our forces are under attack. There we go. Keep that going. Keep them on the move. I do not want to lose my stuff here. I, I lost some. But, uh... Yeah, come on up the ramp, guys. That is working. You're not going to be able to finish that. That, also working. Stop. Now take that out. Expand is dead. Yeah, he's gone. He's not going to be able to do anything here. Oh, I didn't get time. Yay! Alright, so I beat a Protoss again. He went heavy air, but Hydralisks are so good against air. They are so good against air. Had he microed his guys a little better, he might have been a little bit better off. But honestly, with with my macro, I had so much, and I was able to re-macro my army there. And it, it was just, it kept him on the defensive. He had three bases, I think. So honestly, he actually wasn't doing that bad on my macro himself. If we take a look at his uh, worker's active, he's probably pretty high up there. He is. Actually, he's higher than I. But unfortunately for him, it, it wasn't really worth it. And oh, upgrades were a huge part of that, too. I had a lot on upgrades, and that really got it right there. He was actually a little ahead of me, though, as you can see there on the income. But when it comes to the actual army, we were together. Mine went down less, and then his he just couldn't recover because he didn't have the ability to do do so. So, yay for that. He's actually pretty high up in gold, and yeah, he's always been gold. Having a pretty good win last this week, this season too. Anyway, that's going to be the end of this game. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Have a good night. Bye.